Welcome to another edition of Coffee with the Goose, where we talk about things that are interesting, fascinating, and irritating. I'm the Goose. Glad to have you back. And for your first-time viewers, uh, welcome. I hope you enjoy it. Uh, I've got a lot of stuff to talk about today. Uh, most notably, um, I know you didn't call me an old man, but you're thinking it, and that's enough for me. Oh get into it here in a second but first let's have a sip of some good strong coffee strong just like my opinion but got some creamer in there to make it sweet just like me <clears throat> very good getting ready for the big manny pacquiao keith thurman fight it's uh, coming up july 20th at the mgm grand in las vegas uh, what a great story um where you know two polar opposites pacquiao and keith thurman thurman on one hand uh, god bless him great Great young fighter. He's in his prime, actually, I think 29 years old. He's 29 and 0 with 22 KOs. He's, he's a one, one, uh, uh, one time Thurman, meaning, you know, it only takes one, uh, punch to, uh, uh, send you into La La Land. He's done it many times. Now, I like Keith Thurman. He's a champion. He has every right to talk trash and he's done it. One of the, uh, things he's, uh, teased Manny Pacquiao about is he's old. Uh, he's 40 years old. He's had no business being in the ring at 40 years old fighting for a title. Um, and I'm going to make him retire. Okay? Good luck, Keith Thurman. Uh, I respectfully disagree. You don't know what you're in for. But let's talk about Pacquiao's age. How can this guy uh, continue to perform at this world-class level at the age of 40? Most of us at the age of 40 are, you know, we've got grandkids by then and... Yeah, we're feeling a little old and uh, we're not as active as we uh, used to be. And so, you know, uh, but, but Pacquiao is a different animal, as you know. What makes him so uh, fit, so active, so um, effective in the ring at the age of 40? Well, there's many reasons. Let's, uh, let's go down the list. Uh, of course, uh, nonstop training. The guy's training seven days a week. Uh, and when Manny trains, I don't know if you've seen any videos of him. He is, uh, he's in another world. Uh, uh, if, while m many of us are done after an hour, maybe two, he's just getting warmed up. Uh, so Manny, to him, staying fit, staying in shape, staying active, is just uh, part of life every day. Part of it may be uh, genetics uh, and uh, his uh, nationality. He's Filipino which is kind of Asian, but kind of not, I, you know, Pacific Islander. And they, uh, they tend to um, stay very active and uh, uh, they tend to live a long, healthy life. But Pacquiao, again, uh, 40 years old, fighting for a title. What else is it besides uh, training? It's more than just training. Uh, it's, it's multifaceted. You have to take good care of your body. What, what, what do they say? You are what you eat. Uh, his uh, diet is very, very healthy. Fish, chicken, Rice, uh, balut. If you haven't had balut, good luck. <laughs> I've seen it. I want no part of it. Sorry. Uh, maybe I'll get bold here, uh, uh, the next time over to the Philippines and have some balut. But Pacquiao, um, and warm milk, by the way. There's another one. He, he, he will not drink pop, anything cold. He's, uh, almost religious about it. Uh, proper vitamins, proper supplements. And when I say supplements, don't get ahead of me, you Pacquiao haters. It's not PEDs. We just did a video on that a short time ago. Uh, go check it out again. Uh, you know, put the room, we put the rumors to rest. So stop with the, stop with the, um, the gossip, if you will. It's more than that. Uh, you know, I take uh, supplements, whether it be, um, uh, vitamins, uh, the, the first and the most simple supplement, um, Oh, I can't remember now. The pressure's on me. But anyhow, supplements, vitamins, good diet. That's uh, part of it. And when you work out, and we all need to stay active. I learned this years ago. Uh, when you say work out, that doesn't mean you have to uh, go to the gym several days a week and, you know, be an animal. It can mean just walking the dog. So if you're looking to get fit and you're older, or even if you're not older, just take a walk. Just get active a little bit. That'll help you greatly. But with Pacquiao... His workouts every day are, again, uh, inhuman. Uh, he does multiple exercises, and the list uh, is, is very long. Running, uh, pull-ups, push-ups, abs, squats, jumping rope, which every, every uh, fighter does. Uh, and uh, he also uh, lifts weights the right way. I'll get into a little bit more of that uh, in, a, in a couple minutes. Uh, he also is, uh, you know, he works on the mitts. 
Uh, he also hits the heavy bag and the speed bag. And when you watch Manny on the speed bag, I've tried the speed bag. It's hard. But he does it while he's jogging. The guy's just unbelievable. And uh, uh, in addition to that, it's uh, proper rest. We're talking about getting older and staying active and healthy, which is what Manny's all about, uh, fighting for a title at the age of 40. He's learned over the last year or two, rest is a key component at any age, but especially as you get older. I have found that uh, uh, I'm 57 now, uh, going on 10. <laughs> I'm more of a child than my kids, but um, rest, it's a key, but I found that I can still do anything I've ever done. I can keep up with the kids. I play basketball with the kids, uh, you know, who are 30 years younger than me and keep up. But it takes a little longer to recover. That's, uh, that's it. So, uh, believe me, you can, uh, you can keep up uh, as you get older. Uh, so rest is a, a huge component. Uh, also, prayer. Now, to those of you who really uh, aren't in touch with God, uh, or uh, in your spiritual life that uh, can be a great boost, uh, a great weapon uh, in your fight against aging or in your fight to uh, stay um, uh, in, uh, stay active and stay healthy. Prayer is huge. It, it releases your stress level. Uh, it, uh, you won't worry as much. And uh, when you put everything, all your worries and your troubles in God's hands, it uh, makes life a lot easier. So uh, there's some good advice for you. Prayer. Now, I'll give you a little bit of my own experience uh, getting older and staying active. I quit doing, uh, quit smoking, quit doing drugs 22 years ago by the grace of God. Couldn't do it by myself. And uh, at the age of 35, started uh, lifting weights. And uh, fortunately, I learned to do it the right way uh, and for the right reasons. Getting healthy, number one. And doing it uh, with the proper technique not with with ego not uh, uh, entering into the picture at all. When you work out, you try to stay healthy or stay strong. You don't do it to look good or to uh, get attention. That comes with the territory. People will just look at you a little differently. There's something about you. There's something about the confidence, the um, uh, in yourself, and uh, the, the the you're at ease. You're you're calmer. And uh, so I, I've learned that and it's, uh, it's you know, working out is a, an essential part of my uh, daily routine. I get to the gym a couple of times a week, play basketball, maybe swim a little bit. It's, it's huge. And that's, that's what Manny Pacquiao does. So his, at the age of 40, that's not really that old. Uh, there, and there are many other examples of fighters that have won belts even older than 40. The oldest... Bernard Hopkins, who was a super middleweight, I'm sorry, light heavyweight, uh, had a title at the age of 48. George Foreman, of course, won a title, heavyweight title, the age of uh, 45. And the other one that comes to mind, you may not have heard, to, heard of him, is uh, Sugar Boy Malinga, super middleweight uh, titleist at the age of 42. So it can happen. Man, he's 40. He's just a kid, man. Uh, he stays active. He uh, stays in touch with the Lord. Uh, and he takes good care of his body, and, and those are the three keys. Uh, you can do it too. Uh, and uh, again, I have to keep emphasizing this. Manny Pacquiao does not take performance-enhancing drugs. You don't need it when you do things the right way. So uh, if you don't think Manny can handle things at the age of 40, well, you'll find out July 20th when he takes on uh, Keith One-Time Thurman at the uh, MGM Grand in Las Vegas, a uh, world welterweight title in, uh, uh, on the line. And, of course, we'll continue to bring you the best coverage. Uh, and uh, cross your fingers. We'll uh, talk to Manny himself here uh, in the very near future, and you'll be the first to see him. That's it for this edition of Coffee with the Goose. Thanks again for subscribing and viewing our program. We really appreciate it. And don't forget, we are on Facebook on Coffee with the Goose. That's it for this show. We'll talk to you again soon. Take care.